Hey, this is Corey from Distant Imagery. I am out today and I finally get to test out my two fixed wing drones. Been looking forward to this for quite some time now. So this is my XUAV Talon. And these are the best drone technicians in the UAE right here. Great job when they routed all the wiring in, cleaned it up really nicely. A lot of room for an extra battery up there. So that's the Talon. And then this is the uh, RV Jet. Put that one up next. We're going to hand launch it. One thing that you do have to worry about when you hand launch is to make sure you get your hand down quickly yeah. so Mr. <laughs> propeller doesn't take a chunk out of it. That's a stronger propeller than the one on the Phantom. And the one on the Phantom hurts really badly, so that one probably draws a lot of blood. This one too much. Ah, <laughs> that one? <laughs> Let's get in there, I see that. Yeah. Is that from a prop? Yes. Only 15 stitches. <laughs> see that right there? Yeah. That's what happens when a prop hits your arm. A little, 15 stitches. 15 and stitches. Imagine three, four by, three by four, so you know, cut. All right. It's time. <coughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's hope that this goes well and it doesn't end in a, a, an aircraft turning into smaller pieces of foam. <laughs> Fingers crossed. All right. We already ran through the uh, flight controls checks. They're all working. Take a video later. <laughs> if it crashes, got to get that on video. Hopefully it does not. It's work. right into the sun there. Oh, that looks cool. Three points. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, you can see there, it's just flying circles now. Big old circles after it flew those waypoints. And it was adjusting for winds and everything, so everything seems to be working quite well. <laughs> the tracker is following it now, doing its job. It's got a little bit of a headwind here, so it's got the motor. Oh yeah! Literally perfect landing. That's the man right there. Alan is the man.